The Apsa Cape Epic is back, and for the 12th time, the untamed African mountain bike race will capture the imagination as 1,200 professional and amateur riders tackle 739 kilometres with 16,000 metres of climbing over eight gruelling days of riding through South Africa's stunning Western Cape region. Cape Town, South Africa's tourist hotspot, hosts the prologue. The Cape Epic journey starts on the grounds of the historic University of Cape Town on the lower slopes of the iconic Table Mountain. With one of the strongest fields in the race's history, littered with current and former Olympic and world champions and a host of previous winners, it promises to be one of the most enthralling races ever. The prologue is only 20 kilometres long, but with three testing climbs and some technically challenging single-track descents, the riders will get the true Apsa Cape Epic feel right from the start. In the women's race, last year's winners, Switzerland's Ariane Kleinans and Denmark's Annika Langfart of Team RCM Specialised, took an emphatic win. The favourites had a strong start to the race and with a finishing time of 53 minutes and 38 seconds, they are already 3 minutes and 35 seconds ahead of the second place Ascenders Health team. They'll be wearing the women's Sassel Orange Leaders jersey on stage 1. In the men's race, 2013 champions Christoph Sazer of Switzerland and Yaroslav Kulhabi of the Czech Republic of Team Investic Songo Specialized finished in third place after a solid performance. With a time of 46 minutes and 42 seconds, one of the race favorites set themselves up nicely for the rest of the event. In second place, German Karl Platt and Swiss partner Urs Huber of Team Bulls, keen to redeem themselves after Platt's unfortunate retirement in last year's race. They finished in a time of 46 minutes and 36 seconds, a highly encouraging performance ahead of the remaining seven stages. Martin Gujan and Fabian Geiger of Team Novus OMX were the surprise winners of the prologue. The Swiss team, who are off the pre-race radar, stormed around the testing course to post a winning time of 46 minutes and 18 seconds. In their first joint APSA Cape Epic outing, the happy winners were awarded with the yellow jerseys, which they will wear on stage one.